Hey everyone, welcome back. I just want to start off by saying I have uh, my BB cream on, I have Lunar Beauty blush, and I have Ace Beauty bronzer. Um, I tried to make this video a little bit quicker, so I did already get some of that stuff done and I did line my lips with lip liner you will see I got the Barbie collection from Colourpop it just arrived yesterday but by the time I knew it arrived it was already too late to film so this is the palette we will be getting into I didn't get the full collection because I didn't want to pay a hundred dollars for products that I wouldn't use like all of them I wouldn't use the lashes I wouldn't use all the lip colors I wouldn't use the mirror so I got just the palette and this is in Golden Beach the lipstick and lip liner duo and I got the highlighter so we will be doing those right now all right so we are going to try something a bit pinky and we're also going to work with some blue we're gonna do both so let's get into that. Alright. First, I'm going to go in with West Coast, which is this yellow kind of color. This may not turn out exactly how I like it, but we're going to see. Oh, my brush is so messed up. I can't use this brush. Like, if you look, it's like, so let's try this brush. I cleaned it with this brush cleaner that I got, which came in BoxyCharm or Ipsy, one of those. And it requires the brush to be like wet a little bit. And my brush did not do good with being wet and it's basically ruined the brush. I don't like this either. This isn't like fluffy enough, but that's okay. I try to use brushes I already know I like, so I can't blame how it looks on the brush. This is actually coming off a little more orangey than I was thinking. Like if you see how orange that looks. Why did I do this on both eyes? Mm, it's okay. We'll just leave the yellow on both. Because I was going to do one, ye one blue and one pink. It's okay. So then... There's a lot of kick up in the pan. I'm going to go in with Best Coast, which is this pink color. So much kickback. I'm just trying to focus that in the crease. Okay, so this is like, I really like ColourPop. I don't know why this is coming out like a little patchy. Like it is sticking. I use my same primer that I always use. And can you see that? It's like super patchy in there. Oh, let's try a different brush. But I know it's not the brush because I always use that brush. But sometimes I can diffuse a little bit better with this brush. 
Maybe this palette just needs a little bit more work to get the colors to blend. But usually ColourPop is like effortless. Okay, that's a little bit better. It does have, it seems like a little bit of shimmer in there. Okay, so then I'm gonna go in with Follow, or follow the sun, which is this um, more like a pressed glitter. I love their shimmery shades. Ooh, this is actually more of a purple than I was thinking, but it looks super pretty. more to blend those into each other and then I'm gonna go in with vintage doll which is this pink so creamy this is where ColourPop excels is like their cream shadows Like, look at that. And I did not even dig in the pan. That was like nothing. I barely even touched the pan. So pretty. Okay, so then I'm going to take just this clean brush and I'm gonna go into boardwalk right here it may be a little too dark and kind of tap that off and just like blend this all together I actually really like that and I like the little bit of yellow that like comes out of there. Okay, that actually turned out nicer than I was thinking. So let's do underneath. I'm gonna start off with some boardwalk, which was that darker pink. running out of brushes here. Like literally that thing like ruined my brushes. And then I'm gonna diffuse it a little bit with that boardwalk, which is that color that I just went over everything with. Oh my gosh, this is like, now that I got them to blend, this is really pretty. I really, really like that. So do I have another, okay, so I do have another brush set. I may try that. Um, so we are gonna go into some blues and I don't have as much to work with on the blues cause there only are two, but I wanted to get like a beachy, beachy color. And this is Malibu Barbie. So you need like, you need the blue, you need it. All right, so let's, oh, I don't have a really good brush do I now? Let's just try and clean this one. Okay. All right, it's cleaned off. All right, and we'll clean this one because I'll need you too. All right, so we're gonna go into Malibu Memories, which is this blue, and then I'm gonna go in with Surf's Up, which is this. So we are gonna take Malibu Memories. Ooh, that has a lot of fallout, but it is super freaking pretty. Ooh, okay. I see you. This is actually going to be a little more green because I put that yellow in there. That was dumb. Okay. 
it's blending a little bit more nicely over here, but it's still a bit patchy. I can't necessarily say this is ColourPop because like I said, my brushes are um, not their usual form today. I do kind of actually like this greeny, like tealish color. Let's see if I'm gonna go in a little bit. Just... I hate that I even have to use another brush because see there we're getting more of the color. There it is. My bro, like, I'm gonna get out that cleaner and show y'all and like, do not use it. It ruined my brushes and I knew better. I knew to only test, like, test on a brush and I just, it's like, oh, I need to clean my brushes. Here we go. Ruined them, thank you. All right. I'm gonna go in with Surf's Up. So crazy. Creamy, gosh. Look at that. Ooh. This is such a pretty eyeshadow. And this look is super simple and it would have been even like simpler if I hadn't like gone in with that yellow. But like I said, I thought I was doing like, I didn't plan on it. I just went into, like, my natural mode and, like, just started doing that. Okay. I do really, really like that. And then I'm going to take some of Cali Girl, which is this color right here. And put that in this inner corner. Like, look at that shine. And excuse my bathroom because I'm sure you can hear it in this video. The toilet is like constantly running. My husband fixed our one toilet because it was like, um, it just kept making this loud noise. The kids thought there was a monster in their room because their room like is next to the bathroom. And so it just needed like that thing that like stops the water. So he went and fixed that. And the moment he fixed that, then our toilet started making the same thing. It was really weird and he hasn't touched it yet. All right, so I am going to do all over with, no, 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 not gonna screw with it. Not gonna screw with it. All right, so I'm gonna take Malibu Memories. And kind of like. Kind of line. And then I am going take this brush and diffuse some of that West Coast, which is that mustardy yellow color. Uh, but not all of the way, just a little bit. Oh, that looks really pretty. I actually really, really like that. I need to bring that in. Little bit more. Okay. These colors are super pigmented, super shiny. I used everything except for Make Waves, Come On, 1971, SoCal, Zuma Beach, and Shine On. So I would say this is like such a, a nice palette. I will say ColourPop did raise their palette prices. Um, I think this was 30 something for these two, which I thought was expensive for ColourPop. You do get a huge highlighter. 
Um, but normally, like, I think it's 22 or something just for that ColourPop eyeshadow palette. And normally it would be like 18. Uh, so let's get into this highlighter. It's huge, it is bulky. I don't like uh, the material that it's made out of. It's a very cheap plastic, like the Barbie dollhouse plastic. And then um, it's just hard to open and it's very rough on the edges, like for the price you're paying. No. Do I need to dig a little deeper? Come on. It's, where is it? Where's my shine? Come on, maybe I need to break through that first layer. There's a little bit, there we go. I'm starting to get some gold flakes. It's kind of like chunky though. Oh my gosh, did I pay for a highlighter? That's gross. What is it with this highlighter? Because normally I really like, hmm, I really like ColourPop. Especially if you can get an eye, like a shimmery shadow to be that creamy and nice, like you can make a good highlighter. Like, I don't understand why this is. There's some. Like, I like a highlighter that's like, you do it and it's a bam. Like Ofra's highlighter. Woo. Why is this not working? What if I dig in with a more defined brush? See, it's creamy. So it's like just shifting around. The brush isn't really even picking it up. It is obviously like more of a tan highlighter and I prefer more of like a white. Good enough. Um, I, yeah, I won't be reaching for this. This will go to the kids. So let's get into Golden Beach. I've already lined my lips. This is what it looks like. Super cute packaging. Okay, my lips look horrible. But this is actually really nice, pretty nude. Like, it's creamy. I'm just going back over it because my lips are so dry. I do like it. I do like this lip. I will give it to the to the lip. We'll see how it holds up. Obviously, it's going to transfer because it's just a lip, regular lip. Um, but I do like it. I do like it. Um, the eyeshadows, I really like. Um, I'm not sure why they were sticking the way they were and weren't really working as much. It was really just that first pink color that I had an issue with sticking. Um, otherwise, they blended out very, very nicely. Uh, if you have any questions on any of these products, let me know. I am just going to throw on some mascara. And we are done. I probably honestly should have just used that eyeshadow that like inner corner highlight that I did as like an actual eyeshadow and it would have worked nicer. This is just my Epic Mascara from Unique. I got a hair in it. And this is Twisted. And remember, please like this video, share it, comment below. Um, if you're watching this on my YouTube and not my Facebook, please subscribe to my channel. Comment below that you subscribed and that you liked it. And leave me like an Instagram handle, Facebook, 
link, some way, email, some way to message you. Um, that way, if you win this month's giveaway, I can reach you. If you're on my Facebook, obviously just comment below that you've done it and you need to tag me in the shared video. That way I know that you shared it and you are entered and I will just message you. Facebook is pretty easy to, you know, obviously to message you, but I will comment below if I've messaged you. That way if it goes to your like spam or not spam, but like the one where you don't always see that you get a message, like if you're selling something in Marketplace or something. Because that one's a little bit, a little trickier. Oh, what do y'all think? Do you like this look? Comment below if you like it. Um... And don't judge on the fact that it's like two separate eyeshadows together. I was literally only doing that to show y'all what, like try and use as many colors as I can because otherwise I would do one of these looks by itself and then the other by itself. Although together this actually looks kind of cute. It's like um, Kids Foot Locker had these shoes, like they were called like Fire and Ice and they were so, I don't know why I'm double dipping. They were so cute. Parker has them. He no longer obviously fits in them, but. All right, that is that. Thank you all so much for watching this video. Please, like I said, like, comment, subscribe, share my video. I appreciate it. Everybody have a wonderful day. Bye.